Good day everyone. Ang um, isa-share ko ngayon sa session na to is paano kapag nakaka-encounter ka ng error when you submit your accomplished form using EBIR form package. Sa case ko kasi usually or regularly na-encounter ko to yung hindi mo maisend. Ang error niya is overly restrictive firewall or sa slow internet connection. So, pakita ko yung lagi kong nagiging error. Okay. So, assuming nasa EBIR form ka na. Okay. O, tulad nito, ang gagawin mo na lang is you have to submit the final copy to BIR. Siyempre, ito ay na-save ko na and na-validate. Okay. So, submit final copy. Okay. Ito, ito. This is the error. Your return, tax return was not submitted online due to any of the following reasons. Let me interrupt the submission process. Slow internet connection and overly restrictive firewall. So, ang ginawa ko dati is to check kung may problema ba sa internet connection ko. So, let's check kung may problema sa internet connection ko. So, iti-check ko lang if okay ang ang speed ng aking internet. Okay? Kasi nagtataka talaga ako bakit ito yung common error ko. Okay, so for a while. Okay, let me share again. Okay, eto. So check natin kung may problema ba talaga ang connection ko. Okay, medyo mabilis yung speed test na internet speed test. Okay, so nakalagay dito that in, my internet connection is very fast. So, walang problema. So, ano kayo nakakapag-pause? Bakit hindi ko siya na-submit? So, lagi na lang kasi itong aking problem. So, last time, so nakita ko yung, yung kung paano gagawin para ma-submit siya na hindi mo ma-encounter ang error na ito. Okay, initially, nung nanood ako sa YouTube, I found out Doon sa isang nag-share na you have to resubmit na lang. Resubmit your final copy. Pero nung ginawa ko yun pa rin. And then, uh, last time na, uh, uh, parang na-realize ko na parang may something sa computer na naka-install na nagpe-prevent para mag-run itong, itong BIR form package. And then, so ito yung by accident lang. So, doon sa lower portion of my computer, itong triangle na to. Kasi every time na open ko yung computer, laging na-appear itong Smart uh, Protection SMA Dove 2021. Ano man yung software na yon para to protect your your computer. Ano. And then, so, ang gagawin lang natin, ito, laging nag-run yan, yan. So, possible, ito yung reason. So, yun yung una kong hinala. Baka ito yung nakapag-prevent para mag ng maayos yung package ni BIR. So, ayan. And then, nag-right-click ako doon, doon sa triangle na ron. And then, doon sa choices, uh, i-try natin to disable auto-blocking. Kasi, pag naka-enable to, so, possible na itong effect hindi ka makapag-send. So, let's try if it is able natin yung auto blocking okay, check ulit natin if okay. yeah check natin kung yeah naka disable na so try natin eh. you can submit it ayan ayan it's recommended you can choose block to block this program so mukhang ano yung program ni BIR medyo medyo risky but we have no choice but to keep to to select keep run kasi otherwise hindi mo maisasubmit yun di ba okay one more time hindi ko siya na i-submit ng keep run ng ayos okay so let's resend okay keep run lang 
So, let's check kung magkakaigi siya. Kasi ito yung lagi kong error and I do not know bakit ba nagkaganito. So, one time lang last time. So, na by accident. Na, na disable ko yun. Kasi ay, ayan. Okay. So, nakalagay dito, that is submit, submit successful. A notification will be sent to your email. So, we have to, I have to check kung talagang na, na submit siya. May marireceive namang email from BIR at the same time. At the same time, ayan, close. Kikita mo dito sa lower portion, ayan, naka-gray out na itong submit final copy. So, I hope that this sharing na ginawa ko will help you para ma-address nyo yung similar error na ma-encounter nyo kapag merong nakalagay na slow internet connection and overly restrictive firewall. So, i-check nyo kung ano yung software na nakakapag-prevent para mag-run yung, yung software ni BIR. Kasi, kasi mukhang risky no? yung, yung, yung program ni BIR but we have no choice but to run it. Otherwise, hindi ka makakapag-submit ng final copy. Anyway, meron ka namang ibang firewall dun sa Microsoft mo other than dito sa kulay green na to. Or kung meron kang similar na programs na same din naman ang napaprovide na protection katulad nito, i-check mo baka yun yung reason bakit hindi ka makapag-send kay BIR ng iyong accomplished form. Okay? So, that would be all. I hope nakatulong po sa inyo lahat. Magandang araw and Thank you so much for watching.